Hello! Hey, what is up? Um, today is Monday and I have a try haul for you guys but also a vlog because there's not enough clothes for it to be a full try on haul but I still wanted to show you some of the things I got so that's what's going on today. Also, my acid reflux is on another level today. I don't know why. I think it's because this weekend, honestly, and I had a really fun weekend. Let me tell you about my weekend. Let me tell you about my weekend. Okay, so Friday, um, I went out. I don't really go out that much. Um, so I went out on Friday. I uh, went to Del Rey. Uh, I don't know if you guys know where that is, but it's like in South Florida. And there's a bunch of bars and little like um, places. So me and everybody like went out and it was such a good time. And then um, on Saturday, I went to the beach and then went to happy hour. And then I don't know what's going on with this hair right here. I just came home and chilled. I went to bed really early that day because I was just so exhausted from the night before. Sunday, I went to the Dolphins game because I had like credit on Vivid Seats and I haven't gone to Dolphins game before. So I was like, you know what? Maybe my dad will want to go. And then um, my dad wanted to go. So then me, my dad, and some friends went to the Dolphins game and it was such a good time. We had like the seats were like, it's called like club live section. So it like overlooks like the field and like there's like um, bar like there's like a few bars and like you can order food and stuff and it, it was such a good time I've never gone to Dolphins game before. Um, I've only gone to one football game ever and um, This was a cool experience it, uh, it for it like my second football game to be in uh, Florida But it was cool. It was a good time um, I almost forgot I was watching football because there was just like everybody was having so much fun talking I just wasn't really paying attention to be honest and I love football, but I'm like the Dolphins aren't like my team, so I wasn't really like I didn't really care that much. But it was just like a fun atmosphere. Um, but yeah, it was a good time. I had so much fun, and then we went to uh, Bianca's parents' house for a barbecue, and it was it was delicious. So um, it was a pretty good day. But I think uh, the alcohol and like the red meat is just like everything's just sitting right here in the middle of my stomach. And then this morning I had black coffee, which I'm a terrible patient. I should not be having things that spark my acid reflex more but your girl needed some coffee today and i'm trying not to have like milk and sugar and stuff so i just had black coffee with some honey in it and girls feeling it so you guys know the alkaline water like kind of subsides the pain a bit so that's just what i've been drinking i just put it in this cup bianca got me this cup for christmas um, i'll show you some new pieces i got from pretty little thing though so I'm gonna go ahead and try that on because there's some really cute stuff. But everything that I got, I got a size small in except for the sweat outfit. I got a size medium. Let's just jump right into the la, 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 la. let's just jump right ahead into the video and let's get started. Okay, so here's the first one. I think it's super cute. It's very cleavagey. <laughs> uh, but it's really comfortable and I thought it would be like not as comfortable because the material is kind of like tough. But I think this material is good for this type of dress because you know your boobs aren't gonna like fall out and it comes a little bit longer on this side. So I think it's really cute for that sense and it's like more on the shorter side which is definitely cute for like a night out. It's pretty too, it's like an olive green. And yeah, what do you guys think about this one? Okay, here's the next dress. It's just this cream like strapless kind of dress and it has these like lines right here and it's really pretty it's also that like rough kind of material i don't know what this material technically is called because it's not cotton because it's not like super stretchy but it's definitely more like sophisticated and like classier vibes it's really cute um i like the the top of the strapless and i like the lines going down here and it's like a mini dress so it goes like past the knees a little bit as you can see and it has like a split in the butt this next one are these like boyfriend baggy kind of jeans i really like these a lot actually they're definitely super comfortable and i love the denim wash to it it kind of has like a beige wash instead of like a denim blue which i think is really cute and i like that they're low waisted but they're not super big on the waist and comfortable and trendy. You can wear them with like anything really. I love oversized pants. I think it looks so cute. They're not made to be like sexy. Like they're more like style or for like a photo or something. 
bit more casual, but I really like them. And they're like very wide leg at the bottom. Cute. Okay, here is this dress. It's like a tight suede dress. It has this green trimming and this kind of like mocha black slash brown color everywhere else. I'm not gonna lie, I really don't like the color scheme together. I think it's very weird and like an odd color scheme to put together. But um, I like the style of the dress. I like the suede and I like that it's like really tight and short. Like I don't, I'm not really a fan of mini dresses, but when it has something different to it, like the material or something, it's a little bit more, I don't know, I'm more inclined to wear it, but it really fits like the body nice, but we have one more and it's my favorite, so I will be right back. Okay, this is my favorite out of all of them. I love this like camo style sweat outfit. They're very cute. You can wear them like, or you can wear them like, like however you want. But I think they're really comfortable. They don't have pockets. I was just looking for one, but the hoodie does have a pocket in the front. And it's very soft and like the, the cuffs on the sleeve is the same as the waistband and the same on here. I will say, normally when um, sweatshirts have this like band here, it kind of is uncomfortable, but this one is very like thick and like a little bit stretchier so it doesn't feel weird. And then the bottom of the sweatpants are more like a flared out thing. They don't have like the tight uh, string. So I think that makes them a little bit different. The hood, I'm put it up. I think it's super cute. All right, y'all. So that was it for the try on haul. But um, let me know which one you guys like the best. I think I definitely love the sweat outfit the best, uh, like the hoodie especially. If I was going to get something out of everything, it would definitely be this. And then my least favorite was definitely that suede dress. I just think it was kind of weird, like the colors. But yeah. So follow me along for the rest of my day. I'm going to be vlogging. Also last night. Whoo. Guys, last night, I'm gonna bring it to my room because I'm gonna show you some stuff that I also got. Um, last night, I woke up at like 5 a.m. Maybe, no, 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 like 4 a.m. No, I woke up at like 3 in the morning sweating profusely. Like, I'm not even kidding you. I don't know what was happening to me last night. I think because it's a little bit colder out, so like the house gets like hotter. I don't know. But I was sweating profusely, and then I woke up again at like 5, and then I was freezing. So I'm like... Am I getting sick or what is going on? So um, I'm gonna order a faux suit because faux always, like anytime I'm feeling sick, like when I had the COVID word, uh, like a few months ago, I drank faux and it was gone. So I am, I don't know if it's just like, I don't know why that happens, it helps for me, but that's just what it does. So that's what I am gonna order for lunch today. Um, I have to take photos though for Instagram, so I'm probably gonna take the photos first and then order the faux, or maybe order it first and then take pictures so it's like already there waiting. I don't know, but I want to show you guys some stuff that I recently got. Um, let me put you guys over here. Okay, so this is some lip stuff that I got. Uh, Allie actually bought me this lip liner. She gave it to me when she came from California. It's the MAC. Uh, lip pencil in shade cork and that's what I have on right now and I freaking love it I have, This is my first MAC product. I've never bought a MAC and I've never used their products But their lip liners are really good like this will stay on all day for me So I think I'm gonna go and get like some other shades just to like test it out But lately I've just been doing brown with um This lipstick which is the Revlon lipstick in shade 130. It's Rose Teddy. I love this shade I just put it in the middle of my lips and then the one and only Kosas lip oil. I will never use another like lip gloss or product ever again other than this one because this is the best one. Like better than Rode, better than Refi, better than all of them. Like I promise you, I've tried all of them. This is amazing. I love it so much. Oh, I also got a gratitude journal, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, here, let me grab it. One sec. So I got this gratitude journal off Amazon and it just says like gratitude journal, invest a few minutes a day to develop thankfulness, mindfulness, and positivity. I mean, you don't have to develop thankfulness. Like you should just be thankful. I mean, it's like a thing that should just like happen, but it like really helps you like pinpoint exactly things that like, oh wow, like I'm like, it just reminds you, you know what I mean? So 
Um, it's pretty cool. It says like, I'm not gonna show you like what I wrote because I feel like that's kind of weird, but um, you just write like your monthly plans and then you write for, like so you write your month plan and then you start off with like day one, which I have to do today. I'm gonna do it at the end of my day though so I can go through my whole day. So today I'm grateful for blank. How will I make today awesome blank. Positive affirmations blank. Little things that made my day, learnings from today, and uh, goals such plans for tomorrow, and then how you're feeling. Well, I guess I have to do some in the morning at night. But I also got this phone app that does the exact same thing, so maybe that wasn't really worth buying. Maybe it's not worth it, I don't know. But it's a nice thing to have, I guess, just to write it down. I always realize things once I'm talking out loud, so excuse me, I might sound like crazy, but order my phone and I'll make the photo on camera because I'll be slurping that shit up and I'll show you guys what I get. Mm, it's so good, I can't wait. The first time I had pho, I was like, eh, I don't know about it. But then I started liking it. And then Terry, my nail guy, best ever nails, um, he uh, suggested a pho place for me, so I'm gonna go and try that place. So I will be back later. Also, I'm sorry if this is like gonna be all over the place vlog. Like you're just chilling with me today, so you're gonna have to deal with it. But I'm going to New York. I think I, I said it at like another part of the video, but I'm going to New York on Friday, so you'll get some good ass vlogs. You guys know I vlog when I'm on vacay. It's not vacay, but like when I'm away from home. So I've been getting better at it, so stay tuned. Here is my foe. I'm getting deja vu. I did this like a few months ago, remember? Yes, you did. Okay, so I got steak and tend and uh, tenderloin or something. I don't remember? I don't like onions. So we're gonna just drop the meat in here. Noodles. Damn, this is. <laughs> It's gonna overflow. You know Capricornia? Capricorn? Capricorn. Capricorn. Let me say that. Capricorn. And cancers are problems with relatives. A couple's gonna really have problems with relatives. Yeah, I got a problem with you. Okay, now. Me. Yep. Now I'm taking mint. <laughs> this is where like the good shit happens. Wait, this is gonna overflow. Why don't you get a big bowl? Can you get me one? Yes, well, I got, I got, I got, I got. Uh, Lime. Everything's a drink. <laughs> Guys, literally, not too long ago, I had like a beer at a concert, and then I had a beer the other day because it was like hot out, I just wanted one, and my mom literally was like, you drink beer all the time. You're and I had it twice. And then she said, you're becoming an alcoholic. I was like, there's no way you're saying this to me right now. <laughs> also, I don't put the water sprouts because they're honestly disgusting. Yeah, that is so gross. It's no. like the one food that I just can't understand why people like. You know who doesn't have water sprouts? Alcoholics. <laughs> I don't know what this is. I said this last time, but I put a little bit in it. Put a little bit in it? It might be, I think it might be eel sauce. Why don't you taste it before you put it in No, I'd rather just... Mix it all together. Don't argue, just eat. And then this is a tiny bit of sriracha. Good. I just put a little. Oh yeah, you can have some. <laughs> Guys, I never forget this one time. I was I had to be maybe like seven years old, and. My parents got not on it. My parents got pizza like this one night for dinner, and I was like saving the last piece of it because it was like the crispy part and like my favorite part. And I was saving it, and then I like looked away, and my dad ate it, and he was like, "Oh, I didn't know you wanted it." And I never forget that day. Yeah, what's the lesson? Don't leave food around. Don't leave food around. But Daddy always does that. You know how people leave the last best? Well, some people, I don't know. Yeah. And you always leave the last crunchy part of whatever. And oh my god. Mmm. <laughs> Good, right? Baby, when do you oh put yours together? Oh my god. Did you, you didn't get one? No, I don't want I don't like that. Mom doesn't like it. She sees it, right? Mom. No, I don't like raw meat. I don't like meat. Mom. Mom is raw. No, 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 no. You have to taste this. You have to taste it. 
Babe, it's delicious. Seriously, it's like limey. Slammy? No. Limey. Taste it. No, thank you. Why? Guys, this place is amazing. Guys, who do you think is gonna be in the Super Bowl? I'll say who. Well, well, go ahead, baby. Who you got? Well, the Chiefs are really good. 49ers are really good, and the Bills are really good. Wow, you're right on the So, if I was to pick, it's gonna be the Chiefs and either 49ers or the Bills. No, the Chiefs and the Bills are in the same uh, conference. Okay, so the Bills and the 49ers. <laughs> All right. It's going to be interesting. And who wins that one? That's it. <laughs> what about you guys? I'm picking the Bills and the 49ers. We just said that for a while, but I don't know. Um, I think... I would like to see the 49ers versus the Bills. That would be a good Super Bowl. But realistically, I don't know. I don't want to say because why? I have a reason why I like both teams, and I don't want to like not pick one. But the Chiefs are super good. So. They're so good. Yeah. Mahomes so good. You can good. never count him out. You can never count him out. The mm -hmm. guy's just he's too slick. Guys, who do you think is going to be in the Super Bowl? I know I have a lot of 49ers fans here, so I know a lot of them are going to say 49ers. They're good, though. So good. Their defense is killer. Mm -hmm. I would also like to see the Bills win for DeMar and also because Rachel's husband plays for them. Yeah. Well. I like them, too. Tiana. Mm. Small bites. That is small. No, it's not. How's that meat looks raw? It's fucking delicious. Yes, it is. Every meat looks raw to you. Oh. Everyone. All right, guys. I'm gonna finish this soup up, and then um, I have to get ready for yoga soon. Oh, so. really to to yoga. I will see you guys when I see you later. All right guys, I just got back from yoga and I look crazy because it's hot yoga so you sweat like profusely and this is all like messed up because I just tried to like fix it before. But now I'm gonna go and wash my hair if this ever wants to focus, cool. Also, I look really pale because there's not an ounce of makeup on my face and my face is so pale and I just, I don't know why I look so pale right now. But um, I have to eat dinner, edit this video, and wash my hair, and still get it up, and still go to bed at a decent time, so that should be fun. But before I go, I'm going to show you something that I got. So I've been using the same shampoo and conditioner forever. I always use that yellow bottle, the one from, um, what's it called? Uh, it's called Whole Blends. I don't know. I like it because it smells good. But like... It doesn't really do anything for my hair, so I just got this one, the Mane and Tail um, Repair Replenish, because it has biotin in it. And the only reason why I got this was because I recently cut my hair, and you guys know my hair used to be down to here, and then I cut it up to here because it was completely dead. Um, and I've been bleaching it a lot, as you can see. I'm like a lot blonder now, um, and I just need something that's gonna like, you know, repair, replenish. So. I'm hoping this does the job. I got it at Target. I don't know. I got the smaller bottle because I was like, if it doesn't work, at least I don't have to feel too bad about it. So uh, that's what I am gonna do. I bought the sh I bought the conditioner too. Also, how do we feel about the light hair? I know I look really crazy right now because I mean I literally look fucking insane. But um, I posted a picture on Instagram today with like the lighter hair. Let me know what you guys think. Um, but let's go ahead and do the prayer of the day, and then I will be back with another video at the end of the week, so stay tuned for that. I'm going to be vlogging. Also, stay tuned for Monday's vlog. Yeah, Monday, because I am going to be uh, vlogging the weekend in New York, so yeah. 
So here's the daily prayer. Lord Jesus, fill me with your Holy Spirit and with the fire of your love and goodness. May I always find joy and delight in seeking to please you in doing your will just as you have delighted in the joy of pleasing your Father and doing his will. Amen. Sorry, I don't know where I was when I was saying it, but it's so true. Like just feeling delighted in the Lord's love and joy and feeling that like sense of peace having the Lord with you is so, so powerful. And I hope all of you guys are able to feel that. And even if you don't pray and you like remember when I do these videos, like my purpose in life is feels accomplished when I'm able to bring the word forward. So hopefully you guys enjoy that. And I'll also, if you want to know where this is from, Blue Body Brazil, always. Um, this is, they, they've had this forever. It's, I've, I've had this forever. Maybe like three years I've had this, maybe more. No, like three years. And it's literally feels like it's brand new. You can use my code Tiana15. Always get money off. Make sure to check out the rest of the videos. See you guys in the next video. Have a great day and a blessed rest of your day.